Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for July 18th of 2022 well, it is titled Stefan's Quintet from Webb, Hubble, and Subaru. So what do we see here? Well, here's a way we have combined images looking from different telescopes, and in fact, three different space telescopes. And that includes the Hubble Space Telescope, uh, which is a relatively small telescope compared to the new James Webb Telescope. And the James Webb is another one that is looked at here. And in addition, we are looking at the Subaru Infrared Telescope. Now, why would we look at something at three different telescopes? Well, each telescope specializes differently and can see different parts of the spectrum. Now, when we look at light, we talk about visible light, red through violet. But we can also see things like infrared and uh, ultraviolet light. And the Hubble Space Telescope, while it does have a smaller mirror, actually is able to study things in the infrared and ultraviolet in addition to visible light. The James Webb Telescope can see some visible light, but only the reds and oranges in that. It's not sensitive to the shorter wavelengths lights like the blue and cannot see ultraviolet at all. And that allows it to spe specialize in the infrared light uh, that we see. And then the Subaru telescope, not a space telescope, actually uh, on the ground in Hawaii, also looks at visible and infrared light. So putting all of these together then allows a better study of the objects because we're seeing it across a wider range of wavelengths. We're also seeing more detail from some of the telescopes like Webb and the Subaru telescope, which have much larger mirrors than the Hubble telescope. So we can put all of that together. And in fact, looking at all of these images, we can then get a better idea of part of, the, of this quintet of galaxies that we see five galaxies in the sky and studying them. They'll look a little different than if you're used to seeing them with ordinary just optical light. But we can get more and learn more about them from this. And since the image data from these telescopes are freely available, then you can also use them to develop your own images and putting those together, which is what happened here, taking freely available images from these three telescopes and combining them together to see even more detail. So that was our picture of the day for July 18th of 2022. It was titled Stefan's Quintet from Webb, Hubble, and Subaru. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be half star cluster. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.